Hello everyone. Just here again. I'm gonna be doing a nerve react fill again. And this time I'm gonna reacting to the endorsement of his of his newest of his one of his newest videos they uploaded that was, this one was uploaded three days ago and that was on November seventeenth. And so yeah. And the video I'm gonna react to is called Taco Bell in Torito Review. It's back first time trying. Hmm. I never, I've never, never, I've never the Intorito. I had it before, and it was really good back then. It was, but I can't believe every day I actually brought it back. Like I, I love that. I never really had it, but never I had that, and the and the case of Rito back back then. When I first time trying, when I first time trying it. So yeah. So before I even start on this video, on this reaction film, I want to give a disclaimer. If you do not like the content I make. The react fills or any of the other stuff I do on my channel. Channel, if you don't like them, then don't watch it. Go somewhere else. Be getting only because the only thing you're going to be doing is giving me a view, and that's the damn truth. One, that's the damn truth, and nothing but the truth. So yeah, it's not about fair do. Let's get the video right now. Let's get it right now. All right, today's the day. Yo. Today, the day you're seeing this is the day that Taco Bell is bringing back some more nostalgia. They brought back the Enchirito. It's in it's Check it out. Open for breakfast. I know it is huh? because it's 9.30 a.m. and I'm eating an Enchirito for the very first time. We're going to talk about it. We're going to huh. eat it. And uh, there you go. Do the intro. It looks like Taco Bell's been bringing back some of their old, some, some, some of their old items. It looks like it first the uh, mixed pizza what analysis. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something <laughs> yeah. and tell you if yeah. you should like it or not. I can be very, very persuasive. At the Taco Bell windshield wipers working. All right, so 1970 is when this launched. Uh, I oh, even yeah. went back and looked up one of the commercials, and uh, wow. I think they even say something like Taco Bell, where the fresh food is. I think that was their slogan back there. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna check this out. The Enchirito, uh, they did uh, in September, they had a contest where you could vote uh, if you wanted to have the double decker taco return or the Enchirito return. Huh. And people uh, picked the Enchirito, I think it was 62% to 38%. And I will tell you this I've never no. had one of these. And uh, it I was, I'm gonna check the price. It's I'll put the price it's up here, kind of draw a that blank on the it. price. Uh, but I've never had one of these, so it's my first time. Now, it was launched in 1970. It stayed on the menu till 2013, and then huh. went bye-bye. Bye-bye. Huh. Bye-bye, Enchirito. And now it is back, and uh, here it is. It's in this possible coffin of goodness, all fogged up. We're going to check it out. Let's open it up. I don't want to drop it. Now, you have the option to get some other stuff on it. Like, you know, you can, uh, whoa. That is a very strong smell. Uh, well, as I said, you can add things to this. Uh, you can make it supreme. And by looking at this, I probably should have made it supreme, even though I do have some sour cream in the uh, refrigerator. So check it out right there. Returning first time in nine years. Oh, yeah. Check it out. A tortilla filled with beans, uh, ground beef, Cheese on the top right there with red sauce. I don't even believe there's cheese no. on the inside. I think it's just cheese on the top. We'll find mm. out. But there you go. The Enchirito is back. Yeah. Let's take a bite. All right. Welcome back. We are going to take a bite. I've got the uh, fork. They were nice enough to give me two. And mm. let's get into it. This is the returning Enchirito red sauce. Like I said, I've never tried the Enchirito. So we're huh. going to see what the deal is. I'm not going to lie. This actually smells like lasagna. Yeah. I know it's Taco Bell. I know it should be uh, Americanized Mexican food. Uh, yeah. But what are you going to do? It smells to me like yeah, yeah. Uh, lasagna. And it kind of cuts like lasagna because it cuts like lasagna. All right. Whoa. Whoa. All right. Like I said, beans. Is it refried beans? I think it's refried beans. I think it says beans in the description. It might just be refried beans. Check it out. That is a... <laughs> Mexican and Dorito mess mm -hmm. right there. There's a lot of beef, melted cheese. All right, let's go. First time ever having an Enchirito, uh, 2022. Mm. Let's go. All 
All right, so right off the bat, I'm just getting loaded burrito vibes where they put the burrito in the bowl and they lather it up with some queso and maybe some extra toppings. I think even huh. back in the 70s and 80s, uh, these would have uh, olives on the top. No huh. olives. I don't think uh, Taco Bell rocks the olives anymore on a lot of these uh, dishes. Oh yeah, there's onions too, I believe, inside as well. And if I were to get that, get um, and get them again, I will probably do a, do a video on it. And I do apologize. When I found a stable place to call I do apologize home, on that. gave me the opportunity. Dang it. Um, the red sauce. I was hoping the red sauce was going to be like a hot sauce, something along those lines. But to me, it's like a, um, I don't even know, like a muted down uh, marinara sauce. That hmm. makes any sense. I know red sauce is probably something in the uh, Mexican food culture, hmm. uh, but I just don't know what it is. Uh, so yeah, check it out one more time. It is, um, I don't know, it's decent. It's a unique flavor for sure. I don't know how I'm feeling about it. I'm trying to think of how I'm going to rate this. A lot of people love this. It obviously beat out the Double Decker Taco, and I love hmm. that Double Decker Taco when I reviewed it uh, a couple years ago. onions the tortilla is even it's like softer it doesn't feel like a normal taco bell tortilla mm. it might be thicker and softer so i'm kind of uh enjoying that uh so yeah um the enchorito it's back and i'm eating mm. it i think it is refried beans but yeah something about this tortilla is definitely softer in my opinion mm. probably should actually have a knife but uh i'm doing fine i'm doing fine all right, so let's take a final bite. We'll give it a rating. The Enchirito, I would be interested to know, light up the comments below. Uh, did you vote for either one of these? Did you even know that a vote was even happening uh, for the Double Decker Taco or the Enchirito? Um, I probably would have voted for the Double Decker Taco only because I've had it before. But I can I see where I people would, gravitate would to this. It is something a little bit different from the folks over at Taco Bell. And um, I don't know. It's okay. It just has, like, lasagna vibes all over. Like every time they brought back the Mexican taco, I need them. I need the Mexican pizza. They start. They start bringing back their own favorite. Red sauce and the beard. All right. So on a scale of one to one hundred, with one meaning mm. don't even waste your money, and one hundred being the promised land of. I'm going to give the returning Enchirito from Taco Bell a rating of. Ooh, um, this is tough. I like it, don't love it. I would 100% doctor that up with some extra stuff. Gonna put mm. on some sour cream, maybe a couple sauces. We would mm. definitely uh, do something with this. It has a nice base uh, to have oh, yeah. something done to it. All right, so uh, the rating. I'm gonna give that a solid, whew, I'm gonna give it an 84. An 84, huh. I think hmm. that is a fair score for someone who's never had it. I don't have any nostalgia attached to it. And it did remind me of uh, like a taco uh, lasagna, if that makes any uh, sense. And um, it was okay. And I think it would be better if I did put some more things on there. And when I do finish it, I will add some sour cream and maybe a little hot sauce hmm. and uh, pick it up a notch. So uh, there you go. Another review in, in uh, books. books. Please like, comment, yeah. share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media getting the word of my channel. Out to, to the, the masses. masses. In closing, <laughs> let me know. Light up the comments. Did you vote for it? If you did not vote for it, would you have voted for this? Or would you have voted for the Double Decker Taco? And on a scale of 1 to 10, how excited <laughs> are you that the Enchirito is back at yeah. Taco Bell? I am lukewarm about it. <laughs> Uh, all right, so there you go. Thank you for joining me, and uh, we'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye. And I'm going to be stopping the video right there. So, yeah, and that's the end of this reaction film. And I hope you guys like this reaction film. I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like it. If you don't, then I don't care. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those videos well on every time I upload. 
and share my videos, react videos to your friends, family, and also if you want to, it's your choice, because I am making you. So yeah, and don't forget to subscribe to the endorsement if you're new, subscribe to his channel if you haven't yet, subscribe if you haven't yet, subscribe, subscribe. Excuse me. And I'm on the road to 2k subscribers and maybe 3k subscribers, but right now we're on the road to 2k subscribers right now, 2k right now. So yeah, and that's the end of this reaction film, and I'll see y'all for more banger reaction to come, and I'll see y'all in the next time. Give your joy signing out, and peace out, starter legends, and happy Thanksgiving month, and peace out, everyone.